We're not! Oh my goodness. Well, we're here. Now where's the stupid Postly Sanctum? A crystal star's there, right? So they say, your putridness, and lo and behold, there it is now right behind you. Yup. Good luck getting through the door. Great, about time something worked out for old Bowser, in we go. Why don't you just go home and sit on your throne? That's all you ever do anyway. How are the how is things different? Hello. I say, I'd like to mount a large animal horn in my... Seriously?! Are you serious right now?! Oh my god! Nintendo! I... <laughs> yeah, I guess your walk was a little different today, wasn't it there, Miss Robin Hood? Oh, hello there, guy. Possibly Heights is a nice and a warm afternoon. What's that? You're a great and evil king, are you? Really? Hmm. T -t Too much sun, yeah. What are you doing all the way back here? Oh, look, my heart trembles. The fountain, so elegant. This is art at its finest. So very observant, as usual, my dear Gold Bob, indeed. Surely this is... Who's talking there? Yeah, I know. Stop yawning. We're talking about the music business here. You know, defining art by using your money at it, throwing your money at it. <laughs> oh, Bowser. Wow, you're big, mister. What's your name? Uh, <laughs> Businessman of Legend. Bwahaha, <laughs> I am Bowser, Businessman of Legend. Fear my accounting. <laughs> Oh, businessmen like business trips, bribes, and brown noses? Oh, my. Wow, tough life, huh? So, mister, are you in charge of the coffee maker, or what? Ah. Uh... Yeah, we stand around the water cooler and talk about Lost. But even that was too much for me to ask in my job. Nobody talked about Lost there. Or American... Well, American Idol, maybe once in a while. That was the only reason I watched that show for as many years as I did. It was just so... If somebody brought it up at work, I could contribute to the conversation, wouldn't you know it? Never happened. It happened one time, and then I started watching it, and it never happened again after that. Well, it happened one time, actually, I did get to talk to somebody on a break once about it. I think that was about it. And of course, I made my stupid-ass reviews, which were pointless. No, oh, Bowser. What?! You can't have that background behind Bowser! What?! At last, I've gotten my mitts on a crystal star, yes. Impressive work, Lord Bowser. You're the absolute best star-getting guy. Yeah, because of course you can only get one that was just sitting right out there. You there. I have you now, villains. You are common thieves, aren't you? Oh, no. What are you implying? I'm no little thief. I'm... The Shadow Thief. Bowser the Shadow Thief, not a thief, the best thief. I'll be taking this, thanks. What? The Shadow Thief? I knew this had the scent of no mere burglary. Ha! You've been hornswoggled, Shadow Thief, for that is a red herring. A fake! What? A fake? But look at this fancy display, the pedestal and everything, it's so posh. If it's a fake, then where's the real one, huh? If you must know, I give the real one to Luigi. Oh no! What? You have got to be kidding me. You mean to tell me that Luigi beat me here? <laughs> all those Mario brothers are the most annoying brothers of all time. Ugh, bothersome. Hmm. So now he thinks Luigi's got one of them. Like, how much more messed up can this get? Like, now what's he gonna do? Uh-oh, Pear Goomba. Now reporting, sir! Uh, and ma'am, sir and ma'am. Mario has collected the seven crystal stars and is headed for the Thousand-Year Door. What?! The Thousand-Year Door?! What in the heck is that?! The Thousand-Year Door! An unbelievably legendary treasure is behind that door. YARG! 
then I'm going there too, immediately, and I'm gonna ruin Mario! Will you now? Luigi? Well done, lad. Way to not fail, yet. <laughs> Save all game progress up to this point. Oh my god. How have I been going on for this long? Holy crap. I've been recording for like four hours here. So I should probably shut my trap. Because my throat is absolutely killing me right now. We finally got all seven crystal stars! Corking! Now we can open a thousand year duel! Hi, yes, but we still don't know where Princess Peach is. Well, let's head back to Rogueboard, eh, old boy? Well, perhaps you're Mr. Frankly, you can help us find your Princess Peach, eh? Yeah, but I'm about to throw my mouth is melting off like AI, like hey, Haley Joel Osment, that scary shot of him when his eye melts and you're not expecting it, and it's scary, and it's cowy. Ah. Uh... Well. Now we just have to get out of here. I want to go check that room one more time, though. Maybe now that we've beaten the chapter, like... It'll, uh, let us in there. Ooh, it will! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Where are we now, hmm? Wait a second. Tech, are you still alive? Holy jeez! You are Mario, are you not? It's pleasant to meet you. I am in love with your girlfriend. I'm Tech. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Princess Peach. I am so sorry. Most of my data was erased and my main power unit was shut down. Now running on backup power with only cached memory, trying to stay operational. Mario, you know that Peach is not here, do you not? Yeah, we kind of figured that out. Please save Peach. Please, please. Princess Peach is with Grotus in the Palace of Shadow. I had to tell you that. But backup power failing. Ugh, I thought he was dead there for... Mario, use the teleporter room. Get back to Rogueport. Teleporter room is on sub-level 2 of the fortress, I remember. No, I was already in there. Peach is in the Palace of Shadow! Please hurry, there is barely enough power left to activate the teleporter. <laughs> I think they screwed up in, uh, on something there, because I've already used the teleporter. So, I mean, unless everything powered down when I beat the chapter. When the power's all gone, I will cease to exist as an artificial consciousness. But if it will save Peach, I would gladly do this. Because until I met Peach, I knew nothing of love. Do not worry about me. I am just a computer. Just a machine. Mario, you must save Peach. I ask you, please. And tell her... Tell her you love her. Oh my gosh, don't start getting me choked up now. Okay, stop, please. Okay, that's fine. That music wasn't really suitable for it anyway. We will, Tech. So, hurry to the teleporter room now. Mario, save her. You've said that like eight times. Just shut up and let me go do it. And he dies like the Terminator. Tech system failure reported. Mario, we must save the princess for that Tech fellow as well as ourselves. Yeah! Let's see what's on the right side of this room because I've never seen it before. Wouldn't it be funny if there was a star piece in here all this time? That the princess couldn't get. Because she couldn't stomp. Because then she would get an upskirt shot and everybody would see the greatest treasure in all the land. It really is the greatest treasure in all the land. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Ah, uh, sub level 2. Let's do it. Let's finish this episode, good lord. I'm not stopping it there. The bottom of the underground base on the moon. We need to get back to civilization so we can sleep in between episodes. Otherwise, it's not right. Was it this room? I don't remember which room it was. It was one of these. Um, 
I've never recorded for this long before. I can't believe I'm still alive here. So one of these rooms was it. I don't know which one it was, man. There it is, there it is, there it is. Yes, yes, yes. Activate teleporter. Back to Rogue Port. Here we go. So wouldn't I have had to do this before when I practiced? Why wouldn't I remember that this went here? Maybe I didn't get that far. But I know things about what happens after this, so... Oh no, he's gonna blow up! Don't blow up! Ah, oh. Man, Peach goodbye and the shot of the moon and everything, that was like more epic than I was giving it credit for. Crockety, I say, oh boy, did you just hear something? I didn't hear shit. D is he saying I should do something here? I don't know. Can we go back? Doesn't react whatsoever. Apparently it doesn't work. <laughs> well, it sucks to be anyone who got left behind there. Well, if it isn't Mario! What? Over here, son! Oh, jeez, what is that farting fool doing down here? You brought the Crystal Star back from the moon with you, didn't you? No, I left it there to blow up with a thing. What? Talking my good ear. The x not Fortress was on the moon. Ah, oh, yes. So Princess Peach was there too, I assume. Assuredly, but the x not boss took her and made her for the Thousand-Year Door. Aha! Just a bit ago, I smelled some rank air and went to the Thousand-Year Door. I saw a suspicious fellow in a cape go through the door. With Princess Peach! Did you videotape it or something? And you just stood there and did nothing? I mean, not that you could do anything. Yeah. So he went through without the crystal stars? How does that happen? Time is short. We must go to the Thousand Year Door and rescue the princess. I'll run ahead and meet you there. Don't dawdle. You must come immediately. Dude, I'm gonna take my sweet old time. Because you know what? The same thing's gonna happen to her whether I go now or whether I go 20 years from now. So I don't give a shit. Alright. Time to go save. Oh, dear God. I need to sleep after that. My muscles have atrophied because I haven't had to use them. Seriously, we are never gonna finish this episode, are we? Final issue. In a shocking series of events today, local authorities report that Zesty delivered a left hook to the jaw of Gadabout Flavio <laughs> late this very afternoon. Oh, no. Flavio is recovering from temporary memory loss. Oh my god, Zesty has already been approached by a Glitz Pit talent scout? I think the kids got spunk. We'll take the world by storm. My god. Mmm, yeah, so good. What about it? The couple's keg. I know how to make that. Eat it with someone you love, yeah. We don't care. We, we're trying to save the episode here. I'm going outside. I don't care. I don't care if it stretches the episode out for another minute, because I know you guys don't mind. Hell, if you had your way, I'd be posting two-hour episodes every day, right? <laughs> of course, you'd never have time to keep up. But that's exactly why it, this whole thing is just so beautiful. Because you know... Just get to the end. Get to the end, please, fast as you can. I should ride Yoshi. But... I'm so, Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry, too. Oh, man. And the funny thing is, I could totally go on for recording for another four hours if I wanted to. Like, if I really... I mean, I could. But I have no idea, like, what... What I have to do now. Just look it up, I guess. There's Luigi here. You said I already look well-rested. But, well, yeah. I'm gonna stay in a bit anyway. Oh my god, my nose and my throat, just everything down there is, like, swollen to high hell right now. I don't know how I've lasted this long. Did you sleep well? Now you're ready to get out there and face the world. Okay, yes. Alright, next time on Paper Mario 2, guys, we will... probably check the uh, trouble center, see if anything else needs doing. And if there's anything else I need to do, we'll just do it in between chapters here. Or in between chapter 7 and 
the end of the game. So, see you guys later.